The Western Ghats are a sight to behold. They rise majestically from the western coast of India, a 1,600-kilometer stretch of lush green mountains. These ancient mountains are older than the Himalayas, standing as silent guardians for millions of years. They are not just geographically significant, they are crucial to India's climate and home to an astounding array of life. The Western Ghats, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, are a treasure trove of biodiversity. The Western Ghats are not just mountains, they are a lifeline. They influence the Indian monsoon, dictating the rhythm of life for millions. Their slopes capture the moisture-laden winds, unleashing life-giving rain across the Indian peninsula. The Western Ghats are a symbol of nature's power and generosity. Imagine a spine running along the western edge of India, a formidable barrier separating the Deccan Plateau from the coast. That is the Western Ghats, a defining feature of India's geography. These mountains are not uniform. They are a series of peaks and valleys, plateaus and escarpments, each with its own unique character. They traverse the states of Kerala, Tamil Nadu, Karnataka, Goa, Maharashtra and Gujarat, shaping the landscape and influencing the lives of millions. The Western Ghats are not just a physical barrier, they are a climatic divide. As the southwest monsoon winds collide with these mountains, they are forced upwards. This orographic lift causes the air to cool, condensing the moisture into heavy rainfall. The western slopes of the Ghats receive abundant rain, nurturing lush rainforests and countless streams and rivers. The rivers originating in the Western Ghats are lifelines for peninsular India. The Godavari, Krishna, Kaveri and countless others owe their existence to these mountains. These rivers, fed by the monsoon rains, provide water for irrigation, drinking and industry, supporting millions of people. The Western Ghats are the guardians of India's water security. The Indian monsoon is a spectacle like no other. It is a season of dramatic transformation when the parched land awakens to the rhythm of rain. And at the heart of this transformation lie the Western Ghats, the orchestrators of this annual cycle. The Ghats act as a giant wall, intercepting the moisture-laden southwest monsoon winds blowing in from the Arabian Sea. As the winds hit the Ghats, they are forced to rise cooling and condensing the moisture they carry. This results in heavy rainfall on the windward side of the mountains, drenching the western slopes and creating a lush, verdant paradise. The Western Ghats are a testament to the power of nature to sculpt landscapes and nurture life. But the influence of the Ghats extends far beyond the mountains themselves. The heavy rainfall they receive feeds a vast network of rivers that flow eastward carrying life-giving water to the dry Deccan Plateau. The Ghats act as a giant sponge, absorbing the monsoon rains and releasing them gradually throughout the year, ensuring water security for millions. They are the silent guardians of India's water resources. Section 4. A Tapestry of Life, Biodiversity in the Western Ghats. Step into the Western Ghats and you enter a world teeming with life, a vibrant ecosystem that is a sanctuary for countless species. These mountains are a biodiversity hotspot, home to an astonishing array of plants and animals, many found nowhere else on Earth. The sheer variety is mind-boggling. The Ghats boast over 6,000 plant species, from towering trees to delicate orchids, each contributing to the rich tapestry of life painting the slopes in a thousand shades of green, creating a mesmerizing mosaic of foliage. The air hums with the buzz of insects, the calls of birds and the symphony of nature, and the rustle of unseen creatures moving through the underbrush, adding to the sense of mystery. The Western Ghats are a tapestry of ecosystems, each with its own unique charm and inhabitants. Tropical rainforests shrouded in mist create an ethereal atmosphere, giving
giving way to montane grasslands that stretch towards the sky and drier deciduous forests as you ascend the slopes, each layer revealing new wonders. Each ecosystem harbors its own unique assemblage of species, adapted to the specific conditions of their environment, creating a delicate balance. These species have evolved over millennia, perfectly attuned to their surroundings. The Gats are a living testament to the power of evolution to generate diversity, showcasing nature's ingenuity. The animal life in the Gats is equally impressive, with a myriad of creatures calling it home. Over 500 bird species grace the skies, their songs filling the air, from the majestic great hornbill with its striking beak, to the tiny sunbirds flitting among the flowers, adding splashes of color. Mammals, both large and small, roam the forests, including elephants, tigers, leopards, and other fascinating creatures and the elusive Nilgiri Tar, a symbol of the region's unique wildlife. The Ghats are also home to a rich diversity of reptiles, amphibians, and invertebrates, many yet to be discovered, each playing a crucial role in the ecosystem. This extraordinary biodiversity is a testament to the Ghats' long history of isolation and varied habitats, allowing species to evolve in unique ways, creating a living laboratory of life. The natural isolation of the Western Ghats has fostered a unique evolutionary path, resulting in a plethora of species found nowhere else. This isolation, combined with the varied habitats, has allowed species to evolve in unique ways, filling diverse ecological niches and contributing to the rich biodiversity we see today. Section 5. Endemic Wonders Unique Species of the Ghats The Western Ghats are an evolutionary melting pot, a place where isolation and varied habitats have given rise to a remarkable number of endemic species. This biodiversity hotspot is a treasure trove of life forms that have adapted uniquely to their environments. These are creatures found nowhere else on Earth, their existence inextricably linked to these mountains. The unique climatic conditions and geographical isolation have fostered a rich tapestry of life. Among the most iconic is the Nilgiri Tar, a wild goat with curved horns that inhabits the high-altitude grasslands. This majestic animal is a symbol of the rugged beauty of the Ghats. The lion-tailed macaque, with its distinctive mane of silver hair, is another endemic primate found only in the rainforests of the Ghats. Its striking appearance and unique behaviors make it a fascinating subject of study. The Malabar Grey Hornbill, with its prominent cask and loud calls, is a charismatic bird found only in the Western Ghats and Sri Lanka. Its presence is a testament to the rich avian diversity of the region. These are just a few examples of the many endemic species that call the Ghats home. Each species plays a crucial role in the ecosystem, contributing to the delicate balance of life. The endemism in the Western Ghats is not limited to large animals. The flora and fauna here are incredibly diverse, with many species yet to be discovered. Countless plant species, insects, amphibians, and reptiles are also found only in these mountains. Each of these organisms has adapted in unique ways to survive in this environment. The Malabar gliding frog, for example, has evolved specialized skin flaps that allow it to glide between trees. This remarkable adaptation helps it evade predators and find food. The purple frog, with its bloated body and pointed snout, spends most of its life underground, emerging only to breed during the monsoon. Its subterranean lifestyle is a fascinating adaptation to its environment. These unique creatures highlight the evolutionary significance of the Western Ghats, a living laboratory of speciation. The ongoing processes of evolution and adaptation in this region continue to intrigue and inspire scientists and nature enthusiasts alike. Section 6. Gondwana's Legacy. Shaping the Landscape and Life. The story of the Western Ghats is a story written in stone, a testament to Earth's dynamic past. These ancient mountains hold secrets of the planet's history, etched into their very fabric. 
These mountains are ancient, their origins dating back millions of years to the breakup of the supercontinent Gondwana. This monumental event set the stage for the formation of the landscapes we see today. As India drifted northward, it collided with the Asian continent, an event that thrust up the Himalayas and shaped the Indian subcontinent as we know it today. This collision was a cataclysmic event that forever altered the region's geography. The Western Ghats, though not as towering as the Himalayas, bear the imprint of this ancient event. Their formation is a direct result of the same tectonic forces that created the world's highest peaks. They are a product of faulting and uplift, their slopes sculpted by erosion over millions of years. This relentless process has carved out the unique and varied terrain we see today. This geological history, combined with the Ghats' location and climate, has created a mosaic of habitats, from rain-soaked forests to dry scrublands. Each habitat supports a unique array of life forms adapted to their specific environments. This diversity of habitats, coupled with the Ghats' long isolation from other mountain ranges, has played a crucial role in shaping the region's biodiversity. The isolation has allowed species to evolve independently, leading to a high degree of endemism. The Ghats have acted as a refuge for ancient lineages, allowing species to evolve in isolation and diversify over millions of years. This evolutionary process has resulted in a rich tapestry of life unique to this region. The result is a region of extraordinary endemism, a living museum of evolution. The Western Ghats stand as a testament to the power of isolation and time in shaping the natural world.